Welcome back to 12 Sports Tonight, live from Philly. Cameron Cox, Lita Washington on your TV with you. Hey, if you're ever in the city of brotherly love, you, of course, got to check out the Philadelphia Museum of Art. For you movie lovers, home of the famous Rocky Steps, Rocky Statue, and now the Rocky Merch Store. Every year, 4 million plus make the climb of those 72 steps or come out to see the statue. I love this quote. It's not about how hard you get hit, but it's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. That kind of sums up the season for the Diamondbacks. A big reason why the D-backs are in the NLCS right here. 38-year-old third baseman Evan Longoria. He is so thankful to still be playing, right? And the team is equally thankful to have him. Tori Lavello says this, his realness has helped this team grow up. It's been impressive to watch. So in tonight's Sunday conversation, we are one-on-one -on -one with the wise old head of the clubhouse, Evan Longoria. Well, Evan, game one right around the corner. You've done this a bunch of times, but what are the feelings uh, before a big playoff game? Um, I mean, you know, all the feels, right? Like nerves, anxiety, excitement, um, joy. It, it's been quite a while for me, and, um, you know, having that belief at the beginning and then having that kind of come to, to fruition is, is um, you know, it, it's special no matter when it happens. All right. When you think of moments about this year, Evan, a couple come to mind. One, you're slide into home plate, and two, that catch in Milwaukee. To have some big-time plays that help this team get to that point, it's got to be pretty gratifying to you. I think especially because uh, the last you know month for me personally didn't feel like I did a whole lot like as much as I felt like I could have done and yeah definitely um, it, it, it feels good um, in in that moment and then it, it's just been fun to watch the team grow um, you know watch our uh, younger players um, in big moments step up and uh, and just kind of lead us to where we are right now all right, the Phillies, what do you see from them when you turn on the tape? And in this crowd, I know you've been in it before. How rowdy is it going to get? Yeah, it's going to be rowdy. It's going to be rowdy. There's no doubt about that. Um, you know, I, I think uh, the best thing that we can do is uh, obviously try and block that out as much as you can. But um, the stuff that you can't, uh, try and embrace it. If you can kind of block that out and, and just try and have fun, uh, you know, that's uh, that's like – you know, it'll be the ultimate test, but but I think we'll we'll get through it. How do you have fun when they're yelling all kinds of things at you, right? Probably things you can't even repeat. Yeah, we I, I might need to wear some earplugs or something, but uh, <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, there there, there will be, um, you know, some people that obviously you know show up and and they they've got their book of things that they want to yell at you and the they've research done their right. Yeah, yeah, they've done their homework. You know, this is a this is a a, a, a proud fan base that's been around for a while, a long long time. You know, and. Um, They'll be ready, but uh, I think we'll we'll be ready too. Get you out on this, heaven. I mean, anything could happen now, right? You guys are part of the last four teams standing, playing just as well as these guys, hitting the ball, pitching well. Anything could happen in this series, can't you? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you don't get here um, by accident. Um, I think, you know, they know that, and and we we know that as well. Um, you know, a ton of respect for for that group over there. Uh, you know, they did it last year. Like they've been here. We know that. You know, they're tested. They're. Um, you know, they're ready for this moment, and I think that, that we are too. Lena, the biggest thing I took away from the D-backs today and hanging out in the clubhouse with them, they are cool, calm, and confident, and they are ready to continue to show all of baseball that they belong in this moment. And they're dangerous too, Cam. Good work there with Longo. He is just the best. 38 years young and still doing it at a high level. Thank